Hello everyone, today I'll show you how to solve the problem Epson printer not printing black ink. I have an Epson WF3520 here. Um, it was thrown out by somebody that didn't need it, so I decided to give it a try if I can get it uh, going. And after changing the ink cartridges, um, it sort of worked. It was printing, but it did not print the black color properly as you can see it got green and gray shades but the black color is very faint and most of the text is actually missing so what can we do we have the possibility to clean the area that the ink uh, is taken into the printer I'll show you it's easier first of all we want to go to the menu and say change cartridges it brings out the compartment that you can see here just open the lever then you have the different color cartridges here press down this little lever here to get out and two fingers to get out the black ink and as you can see at the bottom here this is where the ink comes out right you can see this little round hole and if we go further in let me get this lighted up a bit so now that we've got this lighted up nicely you can see that this this over here is where the ink is drawn in from the cartridge you can't really see it I'll show you a drawing in a moment but this is what is most likely clogged with old ink and it needs we need to clean this I've made a little drawing of how the top is what I showed you just now is roughly in my bad drawing this little mountain you see here and in case you're wondering this is supposed to be all pieces bits of ink around it here and now what we want to do is clean this it has some uh, holes in it and um, some long entries where the ink is then drawn into the printer this is supposed to be the ink cartridge is put on top of this and then through here the ink is sucked into the printer and if this is clogged it will prevent the printer from using the color even though the cartridge might be full so what can we do I've got myself quite a few q-tips here we're going to take the q-tips and we're going to go in there clean the little ink head that I just showed you first of all very important make sure you get the top of the cubit uh, a bit wet in alcohol uh, just find whatever alcohol you have or not drinking alcohol spirit for cleaning of course and you take it and then you clean the top yeah clean it nicely you might not see much happening as you're cleaning but if you look at the q-tip you will see that it's dirty I've gone it a few times you might have to use three four q-tips until you really get everything clean so once you've cleaned that enough you've done most of the work what remains is to put the cartridge back which I'm going to do right now close the compartment let the printer recognize the cartridge and then we're going to try to print so right now let's print it's um, printing right now remember this is the old printout where the um, let me just hold it where the black color was not really performing as you can see and let's print out exactly the same page after we've finished our cleaning session and let's see what happens now and um, let's see if it's got the black ink oh this is looking good very nice so let's put them next to each other this is the new printout after cleaning the black compartment perfect looks very nice to compare the old printout so that's how you clean your Epson printer if you have a problem with clogged inkjet entries thank you and wish you a nice day